Hi, this video presents a new application called Ergo. Ergo is the most customizable user interface for Windows Mobile, an application used to control a Windows Mobile device. Ergo can be controlled using a finger, like iPhone. But in this presentation, we will use a stylus because finger covers a lot of area on the screen. All icons in Ergo are big enough for finger tapping. After the installation, Ergo contains six desktops that can be accessed immediately, but each of these desktops can be extremely easily customized using a drag and drop technique. The first desktop contains primary information about your phone status, like time, date, missed calls, or unread text messages. The second desktop shows the last incoming call and the most used call list. The most used call list is automatically updated based on the frequency of calls you made to your contacts while using Ergo. The third desktop shows the last incoming tag message, and here you can immediately call the sender, reply, or delete the message. Next desktop shows the most used applications. This list is also automatically updated based on the usage of the applications in Windows Mobile. Next desktop contains major settings like connection manager, running application, volume control, or the other most used settings. And the last desktop shows calendar and major office items. Controlling Ergo is very easy but requires one and the most important feature that is used throughout the entire Ergo. It is a context menu, as you may know it from the other Windows Mobile application. The context menu can easily be used on almost any item in Ergo by tap and hold technique. Now, we would like to show you the most exciting feature in Ergo, extremely customizable desktop. As we mentioned before, any desktop can easily be rearranged in any way you want. To do this, you have to switch Ergo into the so-called design mode. We will use a context menu to perform this operation. The Ergo's desktop consists of multiple items called gadgets. Any gadget can easily be moved wherever you want. You can also change any property of a gadget. To do this, we will again use a context menu right above the gadget. Now, for example, you can easily change a text color. You can also add a new gadget or delete an existing one. Ergo offers up to 32 independent desktops in both horizontal and vertical orientation. That means Ergo offers up to 64 desktops. The number of desktops can be set in Ergo's settings. Ergo also offers up to 38 different gadgets like most used calls, Android text messages, battery icon, operator name, and a lot of other gadgets. Let's have a look at a very interesting gadget, called Today Plugin Gadget. You are probably using the current Today screen, where you have your favorite plugins like AccuWeather, Today Agenda to see calendar appointments and tasks, or any other plugin. All of these plugins can easily be implemented into the Ergo and can be put on any Ergo desktop. So we will add a Today Plugin Gadget onto the desktop. Now, we have to use a context menu to get the list of installed plugins, and we will choose one of them. Once your desktops are arranged, you have to exit to Design Mode. As you can see, the Today plugin appears on the Ergo's desktop. This way, you can easily extend Ergo by features that are not built in. Now, we would like to walk you through all menu items in Ergo. The first one is Contact. The context can be used to make a call or a write text message to any person on the list. In Ergo, you can search for a person using a virtual keyboard. Ergo will search through any information about that person you have, not just by name. For example, you can search for a person's full or partial company name, address, etc. By clicking the person's item, you will get an access to a detailed information about this person. If you would like to add any contact on desktop to get a single access to it, you can easily use a contact one. The next item is text messages. Here you can find all your text messages. You can also get a detailed information about a text message, where you can easily call a sender, reply to the message, or just delete it. The third item is call log. Here you can find incoming, outgoing, or missed calls. Do not forget, you can use a context menu to add any item on the desktop and get a single tab access to any phone number from the list. The programs and explore root items offer you easy access to the list of installed applications and devices file system. Again, you can use a context menu to get more options like create a new folder, rename, copy and paste files, and so on. You will get a finger-friendly file explorer replacement. 
to see pictures, you can use an internal picture viewer. In the settings menu, you will get an access to Windows Mobile settings. Again, you can use a context menu to edge such settings on the desktop. In the system info menu, the major information about your system is displayed, like battery information, running applications, or memory information. You can also easily browse your Windows registry. In the office menu, you will get access to all office applications like calendar, task, packing work, etc. Remember that anything you have just seen can be edited onto your desktop using the context menu. In this way, you will get a single tab access to any item you like. This concludes the presentation. If you like your go, you can purchase it on our website. Thank you and goodbye.